going on, babies? What's going on, Styles? I am back. Back. With a, with a, with a, with a, with a slice. I know I've been gone, but I'm back and I got y'all. So, let's get right into it. I ordered a royal blue wig from EE e. Wigs on Amazon. And I paid, let me see y'all, because I'm looking at my netbook so I can give y'all all the accurate information, though I'm going to leave it down in the description box below. Okay, I paid 40 bucks, you might as well say, 40 bucks on Amazon Prime for this royal blue synthetic wig from EE e. Wigs. Okay, it's a lace front wig, y'all. See, oh, she's cool. Yes, y'all. Look at her. Look at her. Y'all, look at that. Y'all, I'm gonna have some fun with her. So, as y'all can see, you get you get your lace. This is about, I would say about, right here, this is about three inches in the middle area. So, right here, you get about three inches. On the sides, you get about an inch. Um, you get your standard three combs. You know, you get your one right here, that one, that one. You get your adjustable straps. You definitely get your adjustable straps. And let me see y'all if they put a comb back here. They didn't put a comb at the bottom. So you know how like they sometimes put combs. They didn't put one at the bottom on this one. But as I told y'all before in my last Amazon we video, the lemon lime one, I don't care for combs because I feel like they pull your hair out. Um, that's what elastic bands are for. I think they're a little bit more safer and better alternatives. But yeah, y'all, I am so excited on what I'm about to do to her. Of course, I'm going to pluck her. I'm going to bring her to life, baby. And I'm going to add layers in her because y'all see how long it is. I got to add some layers in her. That will cut down some of the tangle. I do get a little tangling, as y'all can see. But this is synthetic hair, y'all, so it's going to tangle. Like, you can't expect synthetic hair. Hell, human hair tangles up. So it just is what it is. But um, it usually tangles up in the night area with synthetic hair. I'm sorry, y'all. That was a rude-ass call I got, y'all. So I got... I'm going to take some of the length off of here because it is a little long for my taste. And um, yeah, and I, I'm making her out. Okay, a little bit more about this wig from the, I wanna read it straight from my MacBook. It says, um, um, she's heat resistant up to 323 degrees. So you can't flat iron her, you can't curl her up to 320 degrees Fahrenheit, okay? Um, all right, and for length, it doesn't have length, but y'all, if y'all look, I'm pretty tall, I'm like 5'10". This wig probably is, if I was just to take a guess, this wig is probably about 20 inches long, 18 to 20 inches long. Um, and to maintain it, it doesn't say it on there, but just use, if you wanna shampoo her or whatever, use lukewarm water, a mild shampoo, you can use Suave. I love Suave for my synthetic wigs. If I wanna just, you know, refresh them. And um, yeah, let her air dry and throw her back on, y'all. So I'm gonna go ahead and take my head off. Okay, baby? Cause I'm finna go from him to her. <laughs> the diva is about to come out. And I'm about to put this on so y'all can see what it's looking like, okay? So, it's clearly looking like, oof. She cute, y'all, I guess. She, she all right, you know? So, yeah. But, y'all, Styles, I'm about to go ahead and start slaying her. And I'm going to come back on camera with a look. Um, I am going to do my makeup on camera, so y'all get ready with me. This is going to be a get ready. And, yeah. Okay? See y'all. So, I'm going to go ahead and, you know, pin her down so she doesn't move while we're working. And then I'm going to part off um, my area where I'm going to pluck, of course, the beginning of the hairline. You'll take your little pieces out. And then, you know, a little bit behind the hairline. And the best way I can explain it, guys, is um, wherever the track begins um, after the lace, you want to at least leave enough hair out to cover that lace, to cover it, and then pin that back out of your work area where you're going to be working. I'm hoping I'm making sense. So that's all I'm doing right here is pinning it back. So it's the full enough hair that I need to cover up. You can use tweezers too if you want. I forgot, I don't wanna leave that out. Or you can use your hand. I find it easier with your hand, especially in the middle part that you're trying to thin out because it's so bulky. And it, it's like, it'll take forever with the tweezers. And then with the hair being plastic, sometimes it don't act as human hair. Like when you pluck a frontal, on a human hair frontal, it just comes out easily. With synthetic, not so, because 
it's like I don't know if they put like four to five strings on one little knot, but it's like super thick. So it's better to just pull it. And yeah, I'm turning it so y'all can really see. And if y'all notice, I'm just pulling it from random spots. And I'm just alternating. I'll, if you notice, you'll just see me keep checking it, moving it around to see if it's thin yet or not. And so, yeah, I will be using tweezers um, too on the front of the hairline. But for now, I'll just be plucking it out. I don't know what I'm doing. I was listening to some good music. Baby, I was, baby, hey, but yeah. Once the plucking is done, babies, we're going to go ahead and make our baby hair. I did uh, cut the other side, but this side, I strictly uh, waited for you guys so y'all can see how I cut my baby hairs with an eyebrow archer. I find it makes it the softest and natural looking. So if y'all can go ahead and see how that hairline is looking, baby, baby, <laughs> that baby, the baby that, that, my hairline looking like it's just, it's going to be growing up out of my scalp. Just blue e Bluey, Bluey, where are you? <laughs> All right, y'all. So remember, I told y'all I was gonna add some layering in her. The layering will um, add more shape to the wig. It'll also remove some of the bulk, and yeah, and then it'll remove the length because I want the wig a little shorter. I found that. The longer the synthetic wigs are, the even more prone they are to tangling. I don't know. That's just me. Y'all, you know, let's get the discussion popping down in the comic section. But that's just what I believe, baby. And like I said, I don't like these ends. The lemon lime wig, I left the ends like that, and that was a no, I shouldn't have. But this time, I'm gonna be curling it. Y'all, look at that, how pretty that looks. So now I'm gonna turn around so y'all can see. So y'all can see. 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 Y um two little pieces out the baby hairs that we cut put the um foam on it and just laid it down with my hand i didn't do anything major then i just tied it down the mold then i start with my makeup guys um i want to do a little mini beat just to bring out the look and I used brother in the james charles palette and the red i used um to use as my transition color which was um you're kidding me a red beautiful red color and um yeah now guys i have a hooded lead so i am still trying to learn little techniques to do on my leads um i can work with bigger leads i love bigger leads but for me it's hard for us hooded leads to get a lot of color on our lead so if any hooded leads are watching please Give me some tips, okay? Um, I tried to even do, I was like, maybe if I do blue and red, you know, in between, it'll go from like a reddish to a purplish to a bluish transition, you know? Um, but nonetheless, the look did come out pretty, pretty good. Um, so yeah. Girl, you better blend, blend, blend. Work, work, work. Blend, blend, blend. And work, work, work. Get it in there. Get it in there, make it fit, make it fit. Don't you let it, don't you let it fall off. You better get it up in there. So yeah, y'all, as y'all see, I am trying to fight for their life to blend that red in. <laughs> they <laughs> blue, oh, but that, but I just keep going, I keep going, y'all. And the only way you're gonna get good is keep going at it. You know, practice make perfect. That's why I'm putting my videos up. Okay, style. So I did already go ahead and cut my crease off camera, and I did go in with the crayon case of the blue, the color blue, um, by Super Crayon Case, and I just went ahead and put it over my cut crease. 
And yeah, I didn't show me cutting my crease. This is a get ready with me. So this is like, like a, okay, you do this, you do that. This is the brush I'm using. This ain't the brush I'm using. So I just wanted y'all to see what goes on in my little life because I love y'all. And yeah. So I'm adding that liner. pop baby just a little bit more pop to it and give it a little bit more of a stamp on it so i'm just taking my time doing that no need to rush especially for beginners no need to rush y'all anybody can do this and oh i forgot to mention that is my new lash line that i'm going to be launching diamond lashes by chris styles and Yes, it's a 3D mink, very natural looking, and if y'all want to know how you can purchase those, leave it down in the comment section, and I will inform you how you can get you a pair. Follow me. So A is to attempt to be the change you want to see. And D is to be different. But tell us what you mean. Like, are you one of them good guys or you one of us fiends? Either way, you gotta eat. Uh huh. Elevate your mind, right? Cause F is for the fine life. And that's how you define life. But I say, G is get back to your home. And H is help the people that didn't help to along. Oh, yeah, fuck it. We go back to F. Cause Once you blend it out to the best of your abilities, um, you bake. And I already baked off camera, so I let it sit for about a minute or so, maybe a two minutes at max, and I'm going to dust off all the exit. Once that's done, baby, I apply my wig. Look at those curls, y'all. And I'm cutting my lace with a razor blade. Y'all, please, please don't come for me in the comments over the cap. I already know my cap was showing. It wasn't necessary for this wig, so I did remove it, but you guys will see that. But, yes. Cut in a jag motion when you're cutting your lace off. It'll give it a more melt look in your skin. Do not cut it straight across. Do not cut it as the hairline once was because it will show the line of demarcation. I added a little side burn it, you know. So, if you made it to this part of the video, you are a real one. Like I always say. So, as y'all can see, um, these are the results. I did a flat earn this week because I didn't show you guys. So, yes, I flat earned it on 320 because the instructions say not exceed 320. <laughs> It's about, to be, it's about being fun. So, oh, I'm so in love with this. Look at that, y'all. It's just custom, just customized. So, yeah. I love you guys. I appreciate you for loving me, rocking with me, and staying with my inconsistent ass. You have made it to this end of the video. Like I just said in the beginning, you're a real one. Remember to like, share, and subscribe. Tell everybody. Tell your grandma. Tell your mama. Tell your papa. Tell your grandpa. Tell your mistress. Tell your side bitch. Everybody. Everybody love me. Everybody fuck with me. Everybody in the hood. Everybody. What's up? Yeah. See y'all. Successful. Came through that new thing. See, I don't know why I trust you.
crazy now, I'm just too on. Maybe now.